Hi boys, you must be eagerly waiting for part 2 of this exit exam. The pattern and orals and practicals, the details, how the exam will be conducted, what our questions will be asked, what is syllabus, which all practicals you will have to do. And in part 1 we had seen what is overall exam pattern and which is consisting of your online exam of 100 marks. Thereafter, it will be practicals 100 marks and orals 100 marks. So, in this part 2 video, we are going to see details of orals and practicals for CCMC All India Exit Exam, which happens every year in June and in December. The details of practical exam or certificate course in maritime catering exit examination. This is for cookery and which all topics are there and how much marks allotted for each of the practical let us see number one hygiene and grooming so total marks allotted 10 marks then you will have to prepare dish one dish two and dish three so three dishes you will have to prepare and you will be allotted first dish will be little complicated second dish also will be little complicated third dish will be in the form of maybe salad or maybe pudding or maybe papadam so those these type of things and marks allotted are appearance 10 marks appearance of the dish then taste 10 marks and texture overall 9 marks so dish 1 29 marks dish 2 29 marks and dish 3 will be allotted 15 marks then you will have to identify the ingredients various ingredi ingredients will be shown to you and you will have to identify and those are allotted nine marks then knowledge of the menu how menu combinations are made for dinner lunch breakfast so for that eight marks are there and like that like that you have total marks allotted 100 marks and it just says practical record book should be completed and must be in order separately there are no marks for practical record book but it has to be completed it has to be in order and it has to be presented to examiner so he is going to tick mark on that let us see now how many marks are allotted for which all topics for orals so cookery housekeeping and food and beverages services and general ship knowledge. So these four topics will be there for your orals. Number one, housekeeping practical. So practical as well as oral, they will be having 20 marks allotted for housekeeping and practical. And beverages services, practical as well as orals, will be allotted 20 marks next will be housekeeping and f and b services 20 marks attitude and professionalism 10 marks identification of equipments various kitchen equipment serving equipments so they will be having 10 marks and for gsk 10 marks will be for general ship knowledge and 10 marks will be allotted for safety so 20 marks so total marks for orals are 100 marks what is the um, each topic uh, consisting of that we are going to see next and what can be probable questions that also we are going to study in food and beverages practical you will be asked to do napkin folding mop plated or silver service and clearance so it can be mop plate service or silver service and its clearance 
mock tea or coffee or soup service and clearance and cover laying for a given menu so one soup one main course and one dessert so for that cover laying so this many topics are there for the food and beverages practicals in housekeeping practical you will be asked to make bed making cleaning of public areas and cabins like alleyways or the uh, pathways cleaning or cabin cleaning glass pane cleaning like glass partitions mirrors window glasses such thing you will have to clean and brass or silver polishing so brass or polishing you will be asked to do so these will be for housekeeping practical in cookery practical menu combinations will be as such so menu 1 menu 2 will be little bit difficult and time consuming whereas menu 3 will be light because it is having only 15 marks other dish 1 dish 2 are having 29 marks each so let's see this dish 1 dish 2 dish 3 just combinations so total about 16 menus are given here for the exam purpose and the combinations of it so let us see first combination mutton vindaloo this is dish 1 boiled rice dish 2 and green chutney is dish 3 okay another combination permutation we can see is cream of spinach soup so making of soup then caramel custard and jacket potatoes so another combination we can see bread rolls cold slaw and scrambled eggs so this will be dish 1 this is dish 2 and this is dish 3 another combination medu vada rasam or porridge so dish 1 dish 2 dish 3 another combination khichdi masala fried fish or and toss salad so dish 1 will be khichdi dish 2 will be masala fried fish and dish 3 will be toss salad on cookery what oral sample questions which are given here are name any five kitchen hand tools five heavy duty equipments or like name five salad items three cuts of vegetables three bread varieties three cold or sweet preparation or it can be name five soups different type of soups two milk products two herbs used in western cookery so these type of things will be asked and this is what is roux and what is mirepau so these type of things also which are little uncommon those also will be asked so these are sample questions given on cookery let us see hygiene oral questions sample questions see five personal hygiene code and procedure for washing hands okay or it can be temperature danger zone and thawing or what are potentially hazardous foods and meaning of food contamination or spoilage so these type of questions can be asked or what should be the temperature of frozen zones or frozen store list two ways of discouraging cockroaches and rats on board what is meant by minimum infective dose so these type of questions can be asked let us see now some sample questions on food and beverages services orals so what is miza place list miza place required for breakfast service or it can be what is meant by miza scene or name any two types of services name five qualities five etiquettes five duties of general steward on board the ship or it can be what is chefing dish used for 
or it can be what area the contents of crochet set or list three atoms placed at the center of the table while setting up the cover it can be name any two liquors or two spirits so these type of simple questions or little odd questions also can be there for f and b services let us see now some questions sample questions on housekeeping okay so questions can be like this how would you sort linen before washing name two types of washing machines or it can be name one brand of polish to be used for polishing the brass or silver items then how do you clean glass panes or it can be what is the use of hydro extractor or it can be where do you find a shower curtain or it can be what is known as spotting so different different questions can come some are easy or some can be little bit uh, uh, not known to you so you which you will have to prepare let us see what can be questions on general ship knowledge and safety okay so different type of ships and their functions so various types of ship which carry different different types of cargo that you will have to be knowing then terms that is like parts of the ship so bow stern midship forecastle wheel house engine room cargo spaces holds etc terms defining position or direction of the ship like forward direction aft direction port side starboard side or location of the draft marks load line marks ship's name and port of registry then meaning of jetty berth docks dry dock alongside ship mooring so this type of questions also can be asked then maintenance of galley equipment then personal safety what safety you will take when you are working as a steward or as a cook then ship safety health and hygiene and lsa ffa equipment articles of agreement articles of agreement are contracts your working contract then official log book and personal documents personal documents are like your cdc or sid passport all your original certificates so questions will be asked on these type of things which will be having 10 marks for general ship knowledge and 10 marks for safety so total 20 marks for gsk and total orals will be having 100 marks friends we have seen how the exit exam will be conducted and once you know that you can prepare towards that achieving your goal and study accordingly so i hope this information is very much useful to you and which will help you to sail across from one shore to the other shore and successfully complete your this ccmc certificate course in maritime catering and pass the exam if you have liked the video please like it share with your colleagues subscribe to the channel and captain joke wishes you all the best and signing off here thank you